Thank you for reminding. There you are. All right. So let's discuss and talk about opportunity recognition. Okay. All right. So um, most of the content of this material comes from our friend or from the our speaker, you know, from um, the the managing director of the Stratarja Center for Entrepreneurship and Technology at the University of California in Berkeley. So that's why you, you'll see here a photo of the tower of the university um, with the backdrop of the uh, San Francisco Bridge. You know? So the very popular bridge in California. And you know, the background is that um, Kitasa CSU is one of the 10 universities um, we I proposed for a project called the Field Dev Tech Hub Project, and through the Field Dev, we're able to get a slot no, to attend uh, the, the opportunities presented to us through the entrepreneurship or technopreneurship webinars or trainings. So face to face before. So that was before the pandemic. Okay, so I'm, I'll be using um, this material because, um, yeah, not just, um, I don't know, no, it's a very good from, from Ken Singer is himself. No, he's a very popular person in, in UC Berkeley in terms of opportunity or in terms of entrepreneurship. But basically, this, this uh, um, ideas that um, really like um, new to, probably new to you, but uh, during the uh, training before, what's new to us as well. No? So, okay. Uh, let me proceed. No? So, um, opportunity recognition. Um, wait. So, so, I think I'm on the right slides. No? So, because there is two versions for this. There are two versions of this. <laughs> if, you, if you watch the man, no? so lo looking at the bulb. So, basically, we always talk about uh, the bulb is a presentation of ideas. No? So um, when the bulb lightens up, then it sounds like we got a very good idea. No? So we thought about a very good idea. So um, for us guys, no? so um, opportunities comes. I think one of the things that I remember from one of the very popular here in a businessman in Duplan City, um, she mentioned that, um, she mentioned that basically opportunities are everywhere. No? So opportunities are everywhere. It's just up to us to spot them and recognize what we need to do so that we can maximize the opportunity we have when there is an opportunity uh, opportunity uh, presented to us. No? So opportunities, so opportunities are all around us. It's just up to us to recognize them and make um, Parang maximize our, our chances of getting something out from those opportunities presented to us. But sometimes these opportunities are hidden from, from our views. No? And for us, um, there are real opportunities that are really difficult to see because um, there is different perception. No? For us, if we are not uh, aware, we're not uh, but I'm consciously aware of the opportunities present to us, then we might over just overlook at them, no? overlook those opportunities, overlook them. So this award there, uh, this talk, I think that's how they pronounce it. So we see what we want to see. So Iana, no, our brain is hardwired to like um, process or recognize the kind of visual uh, presentations provided to us, no? things like that. And for the next slides, I want you guys to chat in the chat box. So chat now, the first, kumbaga, when you see it first, when you see it first, immediately type what kind of figure you see. No? So just, just an exercise. Unsa kayo makitaan, no? So when I flash this, um, image, so unsa kayo makitaan, immediately. So what comes to your mind? Then write them down, please, in the chat box. All right. So I hope uh, you're ready now. So here, what do you see first? Can you type it? All right. Type everybody, please type. Okay. So face, face, a face, a face. All right. 
Okay, thank you guys. Thank you very much for your answers. So let me read first. So si Jessa, let, let me see first, I think the one who, ano, si Larissa face, Jessel face, Matt, uh, I said a man. Okay, oh, Jessa said woman's face. Si John Carlos a face. So medyo safe, no? An answer, ang face, face. And Colonel has a different answer, man playing saxophone. And Maria said man playing saxophone. Meryl Jan said man, and then Kiana face, man nga nag saxophone, all right, human face, si Wilmar, Pivillian said man nga nag saxophone. No? So basically right there and then uh, the instant you see the image, many of us would immediately describe it as a face. No? So there are very particular answers, just specific on sila man's face, then woman, woman's face, no? and, and then uh, it came late nga uh, a person who is playing saxophone no? so 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 dark nga area so we when we spot no? so for example here in this exercise we kind of parang acknowledge no that uh, each one of us may have our own perspective in terms of viewing a particular image viewing a particular situation no? so we have different um mga siguro uh, we have different perspective because maybe some of our experiences told us before. No, if we things like this, we see things like this, then immediately that's I don't know. So our brain kind of hardwired to spot these kind of things because of our previous experiences. But here it's also true, no, that an opportunity for one person may not be an opportunity for other person. So let's let's kind of accept like that, no, no. If we see, if I see an opportunity uh, here, some others or a few others or many of you guys may look at it differently. So we kind of have a different perspective on it. No? So that's why many of us would also argue, no, because we have different perspective. And I think for me, that's healthy you know, when we fight uh, or we argue because, of course, we have different perspective. And sometimes... If you see that in, in 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 a discussion, so even me, no, well, I my having, well, I'm having this class today. You might have different perspective as well to what I'm saying, and it's good. Um, if you air that, you um, note that, type that in the comment section because um, I cannot say all the time that I am always correct. No, so the power perspective is entirely different when you see things, when you describe things. And, and when you think about things, and most of these are like I, I think I mentioned already that uh, our our history, you no, know, so our experiences tells us that things like this. When you see this now, maybe looking back for the last 19, 18 years of your life, so you think see things this way, you no? Know, so you know, so there is these different perspectives. And that is applicable to the ideas or the business opportunity out there. No? So, for example, um, others might consider that selling items in Shopee um, is a great business opportunity. But others don't view it that way. No? So, well, I don't like selling products in Shopee, right? So, I might as well, like, well, choose other, choose other item, no? So, so I... <laughs> Uh, I was really fascinated with this shopping uh, ng live, you know? uh, Okay, can I, okay, pakita nila ang products and then they're really selling the products online. Mga shorts ba na, mga t-shirts ba. Um, they considered as an opportunity no, for them to make money. You know? So there's, sa kalisod na panahon karun ba, you know? so grabe ang paningkamot. No? So yung ability ko ano, yung sailahan, no? because, I, because they did um, parang marag live they tried or done the best that they can to find opportunities to make money and then selling online is one of the great opportunity for them and then for me i think i can do that but then it's different for me no so it's different for me so my comment you know my wife nga oh magtinda tinda ka online gabi tong my 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 eh percent nya my number one so mas pamilya man siguro mo ana no so so so, siguro if I'm selling my own products there, magkatawa ko, okay, maybe some of you guys will see me, no, 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 it's the no, but, pero many of them, like, sell online beyond the office hours, no, mga 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, because people are also back at home if they're coming from work. 
So this kind of perspectives are like for me, for them, this was a great opportunity to sell products online. And every day they have a stream of cash coming in, not to to support their their family. And it's a good thing. No? So these are business opportunities that this may not be technology based, but the thing is that they kind of earn money. No? So they have this opportunity to earn money. So we have different perspectives on that. Okay. So feel free to chat no in the chat box kung koan. Kailangan na mo yung mga comments if you want to also share your thoughts. So okay lang ko na and then I'll try to cover them no to to read them as as much as I can. All right. So another power perspective. So in in just just look at this uh, and read this. Five times more people are learning English in China than there are people in England. So the world belongs to those who see its potential. So many China recognize this that English is still the international language not to to learn and I think um you happen also to notice that a lot of Koreans diba right? um South Koreans um study here in the Philippines to learn more about English because still uh, the popular language is still in English and there are a lot of opportunities maybe work and then they can use it in business when they are very good in english then they can transact business in the us and the european countries and so on the thing here is that in terms of the perspective you would think that well uh, even the english nation countries like england like in the united states so a lot of of chinese now no a lot of people in china are really willing to learn about english no? so so even if the population there or if ever, even if the english speaking language or the population of english speaking language in the us and the united kingdom the uk you know so mas dagan pang sigid doon og english in in china and sometimes nga even in even if even those people in the us uh there is a declining problem no this have declined this a decline of uh, good kanang writers and speakers of english so bina kanang sa grammar down no apart so, ang ano yung mga perspective no? So, um, ako I'm, I'm interested no to learn about chi, chi, Chinese no. So, well, um, <laughs> wala mo na ito. So, uh, yeah, there is an opportunity, but then uh, I don't have much time no to to learn. So, this is kind of uh, another example of the perspective. No? So, next, okay, let's discuss about idea versus opportunity because uh, most of us um, we have plenty of ideas good so you know we kind of like every day you can come up with a lot of ideas no? so it may not be about related to techno technopreneurship or entrepreneurship but things like kanang uh, gusto niyo buhaton sa balay gusto niyo i-improve yung balay how to improve your house while uh, you, we are experiencing experiencing the pandemic. So how can you like uh, make use of your time while at home, like my garden plant so things like that. So there are ideas. No? So usually idea is a thought, and most of these ideas needs to be like um, translated to a tangible um, item. No? So getting idea. So it always remains an idea if we don't do something about it no? so but opportunity on the other hand creates a need for a new product or service no? so there is a from so if you develop a product that there is a need no when we talk about the other way so that means to say that potentially what you are trying to develop no for a product or a process or a service so people might be willing to pay that uh, will people will be willing to pay you in in exchange of the product or service that you want to sell them you want to offer them now so that is an opportunity so i i think i mentioned to you guys that um one of my parang idol or kanang uh, i'm inspired not with this uh, technopreneurship um journey is elon musk now so he's the founder of spacex i mentioned that in tesla um I, I read this in this book. No, in his book, um, he, he told the author that uh, there was this one time when he was even in college days. There was this mass gathering of people around the uh, parang central, parang park, no, parang park. 
And then during that time, parang they were parang celebrating the parang ano mo nang there was a celebration that requires a candle. And and during that time, many people uh, wala na kadala o kandila, no? So some only brought candles with them. And Elon Musk going there, then like he was like around 18, 19 years old, and then he saw that uh, like he saw that there were only few people who were like um, raising the candle, no? So ano siya, then he thought about so he has an idea, no? So he has an idea. I think uh, it would be good, no, for me to go out and then buy lots of candles and sell sell this. Sell, sell the the candles that he can buy to the crowd. Now, indeed, that happened. No, so so he he bought a lot of candles and then bring it back to the park and then began selling and then people were like, hmm, they were selling it, they were selling, they were selling, they were selling. No, so that's kind of the opportunity that uh, that was created no, during that uh, rally. So I think also on the Airbnb, if you follow the video that I mentioned to you, so. Basically, sa katong mga Airbnb founder no that we mentioned, um, ang ilang ilang you know na is during the primaries, di ba sa US when during the election there is the Republican and Democrats. That was the time of Obama, no and uh, McCain. No? So uh, they developed nga the gan kayo followers no, the gan kayo followers of Obama and the gan kayo followers of John McCain. And so they thought they they want to develop a parang so before they ano no went to the Airbnb na idea. So they were able to develop their own products na uh, actually they printed lang a box and then they bought a own ordinary nga mga uh, oats ba to? Uh, so dili sa oats no? kanang mga gina, gina cereal, na cereal. So they repack the cereal using a package na ang naong is si Barack Obama so Obama O and then si John McCain put on the other hand. So They sold that for like about siguro mga 1,000 ka boxes, uh, 1,000 boxes, or things like that. No? And then um, package it in a way na limited edition. And then during the primaries, people were gathering supporters of Barack Obama. They, they love the package uh, because those guys, the founder of Airbnb, are designers. So they, they package it, they, they develop a very good package. So reflecting the Obama No, so they were able to sell those for a very high margin, and they were able to earn money. I think uh, around thirty to fifty thousand US dollars. So, so that's where, like, uh, for them, they were able to kind of have an idea, and then they were able to present that opportunity to people who are followers of Obama and uh, followers of John McCain. No, so of course we know that uh, Barack Obama won the election. So those are the idea versus opportunity. No, so. If we only have an idea, so sometimes we have to fit it to the to the conditions that we are in. Is there maybe the question would be for 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 us guys is that is there an opportunity for this particular idea of ours? So na ba opportunity no to to do business no? So na ba siya na ba siya opportunity? Would people be buying? buy this would people be willing to even if for a special amount of money are they willing to shell out money to buy this idea that i have no so so this is where uh, the, the entrepreneurship journey begins no? so with the opportunity presented to us so sometimes we create that opportunity for people not to to appreciate the product so just, just like the apple product no? so You know, they're pushing the technology to the market. So ngayon ano? They're pushing the technology to the market. So people love the product, and then so so they buy. No? So because they love the product, so they push that. So but there are also opportunities for business that are really dependent on the needs, no need. So we mentioned that about the face mask, no? The opportunity to mass produce face masks, no? So during this time of pandemic, so we need to say we think about. What are the needs of today that we can capitalize on? No, so so that's why ang uban, the uh, gantayo, I think in China, no, so they develop the face shields. No, so sa una problema kayo sa pagguan ng face shields, no. So na uban yung katong ginagamit mga industrial mga dagko kayo, so we have that. 
<laughs> during that first you know, because miss si Mrs. Kinala siya mag-ground sa hospital so that ko kaya yung <laughs> yung patient na magtatawa ko right but then during today uh sa mass production so we have mga plastic na mga tissues no? so these are opportunities no business opportunities that are presented okay i hope that's clear no so find that opportunity no? so find that opportunity and we'll be discussing a bit more about this okay so again idea versus opportunities uh, as as mentioned by here okay sorry so potential business opportunities are built on good ideas but not all good ideas translate into valuable opportunities. Um, I think uh, we have to, to remember that as well. No? So that's my point earlier on as well. No? So we need to understand the key difference to making the right decisions in terms of pushing products or services or ideas that we want to work on. No? So we have to recognize this. So um, it's it having a very good idea will not be enough. So, so I would leave you as that. So we need to find those opportunities na, and we can introduce a very good idea to those opportunities that would be very good. So in terms of can I looking at internally for, uh, in looking at our businesses internally, you know, if you're a big businessman already or can I, if you're an industry already, so, so there's this, uh, I will not take discuss this as uh, long because this is more on like if you have already an established business so that means that we focus on within no when we talk about internally focus within the present business that we have so what are the opportunities that are being presented no for this particular condition that we are experiencing right now for example in pandemic and the other one is focus on changing the business no? so changing outside the business organization or the industry so um Taking on opportunities now, for example, the case of the smartphone business before. Um, yeah, so it would have been good for Nakia no, to like um, parang sought that same opportunity that Apple and Samsung actually did. No? So, so that would be would have been a better choice now for them. So they did not look at that. No? That is an externally focused kumbaga, no, na item. Okay, so, okay, uh, at this point of time, uh, let me share some one video about how the idea or the opportunity was presented to these business founders, no? so tech company no founders. So, unsa day na tabo sila, so what happened? Ayo makadungog mo, no? I hope you can hear it, although it's a background and a lamp music. Hmm. Play audio, okay. I'll just try to reshare it. Okay. Share sound. Okay, sorry. Sorry, guys. So let me start it again.
Okay, I I think uh, many of you commented no na uh, wala na dunggan. So I just cut it short no. So that was about the Uber no. So how Uber started it all. No, so how they actually um how how the opportunity was presented to them. So basically the first part of the video. So I'll not finish this one yet. So wala may you know wala to narration no? it's just uh, playing the actually the images before you so if you read them so that's that's the thing that happened with uber no? so basically all right uh, let me proceed na lang, no? so there are things that uh, actually allow us not to find the opportunity and uh, these are some of the methods the popular methods that uh, are introduced to us okay so if you are into movies guys so i think many of us no, i think Today's generation, uh, all of us love movies, no? so we always love movies. If not movies, uh, many of you love to read books, no? so uh, especially in maybe novels. No? So, um, yeah, that uh, novels na imo movie, no? so kana po siya. No? So, um, for, for us in this particular section or item number one, so this is a mashup, no? this is a mashup, like a combination of one genre and another genre and um if somebody somebody thought about well like for example in the left part not so star wars actually this was coming from the western genre wherein uh, people of the past several decades they love movies about kanabidong mga cowboy cowboy gera no so murag ka na pinusila no so they they love that kind of movie no so violent kayo uh, that's why in the US right now, there are violent nga series, like for example, the Squid Games. Mo, so very violent. Pero so people love that kind of genre. No? And then there's this space also about space movie. No? So going outside, no, like Mars, going to anywhere in the space. So they kind of combine that. that the idea is uh, how about like battle in space? No? So that's where the uh, star wars um came from no? so so th they love this idea of remakes and transforms no? so also this is where the idea um came out from for the movie alien no? so the god Pilanica movies about alien no? so there was this joss movie that you also perhaps see no so do joss on yeah but then so when we say just na like mga sharks nga the kokayo kwan ngipo no and then in space so they combined that idea and came out with a movie in alien and this kind of movie series actually catch the attention of those people in the hollywood no and then um the movie goers really like it and love it and so um these movie producers and these writers were able to come up with a very good movie and then they were able to capture the imagination of the people that they were able to earn money. You know? So billions of US dollars you know, in income based on the Star Wars and Alien uh, series. So meaning to say they, you can mash up ideas. You know? So you can combine things. So you can combine. So the only thing is that uh, what are the things that you can combine? You know? So that, that's the question. So for this, this is also particular with the genre. No? So, okay. So I think what happens is that, siguro, no? so for example, today what we have is a mobile phone technology and then maps. No? So you are able to develop a platform or software like the Uber, the Grab, you know, to use the mobile phone to become your parang navigation system, for example from going one place to the other okay so that's kind of a new idea no? so basically kanang directions kaning sa um, mobile app uh, no? so kaning sa ways so it was developed by the uh, israeli no? in israel so the, then google bought them so basically the idea was something like that as well so for, for this particular case uh this is called the high concept no, so it works for companies as well. Uh, when YouTube came out, when they were able to develop YouTube, so before the YouTube, there was this Flickr. 
and then the pre Flickr platform allows you not to post videos as well. So now you have this video, this this internet platform, and then some of the founders who used to work in Google designed from Google and then launched YouTube. No, then they were able to produce this platform. No, that people can freely post YouTube, make themselves known to the world. No, so there were a lot of opportunities in YouTube as well. So they were able to to come up with the, this idea. No, the guys, you can freely post your your videos, and then yeah, so you can make your own videos. No, so before it used to be that the kanila mga media companies. No, so the only the, the major companies are only parang they have the uh, authority to like de de develop present the videos that they created now but with youtube everybody I, I think you've known already the the story about youtube now so today even you guys can can um, kind of produce your own video now and earn money from from that so there is also an opportunity here diba right? so if you're a youtuber no so and and then you have millions of followers um if you have a very specific content no, that you want to focus on then a lot of you guys may be able to earn money as well no? so so if you're like going into like develop a very good content, no, so it may not be going viral, but then if you have a very consistent content, no, develop each week, uh, every month, then no? so the guy can you know, so video, uh, but they depend their their life's income from YouTube, no, so I think you guys are very familiar with Divana Alawi, no, so she has millions of millions of followers, no, so. There's an opportunity for you, for you there as well. So we, there is an opportunity, but again, it's up to us to recognize that that is indeed an opportunity for us. Okay? Because it's just an idea, but then if we don't do something about it with the opportunity presented to us, then that remains just an idea. You know? So that needs to be transformed you know, para you guys can have the opportunity. You know? So we're not specifically even like, talking about introducing a technology-based product. So more of, of the business opportunity that are presented to us. No, so this is just one of the examples. So so for this, the trick is that no one else is doing doing it. No, so meaning to say it has not been done before. So that makes it an innovative way no, of introducing a product because nobody done it before. No, so unsakan na siya. No, so... So those things that you can consider as well, okay? So these are some of the examples. I will not discuss um, everything, but uh, YouTube is a very good case from here, okay? Uh, harness the aftershock or catching the wave. Now, a thought process used by relative technologies that is being acquired by Oracle. So number one, so again, we're still spotting opportunities, no? So observe a chain. Consumer will purchase more goods over the internet directly from manufacturers. So instead of retail stores, no. So um, example, the Nikon camera. So people tend to do that now. But you know, for today, uh, people tend to compare products not anymore only from the the company's website. No? So they want to compare what is available to, for example, in Lazada or Shopee. No? So so they they look into those um, the those um, avenue no so those platforms. So second is identify a second order implication and validate. So consumers will not be able to receive customer service from retail stores and will therefore start calling manufacturers at their call for product help. So 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 for them no so if there are like the the problems like for example if you are related to goods no so sometimes when you you have problems, for example, in Shopee or Lazada because they don't exactly own the product technology, no, unless if they are being sold by, for example, in Lazmol. So the company itself is selling there. No? So that's that's kind of the, the situation there. So um, given these problems above, so uh, Oracle actually developed a product no, to solve this kind of problem. So they, they saw these problems coming in and then they identified that as an opportunity to for them to develop a new system to answer the consumer questions more efficiently. That's that's the same thing that is true basically for the VPO industry that we have. Okay. So um, some other founders 
uh, tend to like consider looking into how they can disrupt the process, no? how they can disrupt the existing process. Like for example, uh, I think this is Salesforce is not very popular with us. No? Um, I think the one that was very disrupted also in terms of like um, finding jobs, diba? the job market. No? So, um, diba? Uh, the, this, this website right now that you can post the resume and then you can post and, and the companies can actually like get uh, hiring from that. So things are uh, being disrupted and uh, people who kind of catch that attention, um, who got that opportunity not to disrupt the business, that means that they have this opportunity for them to develop products and services. And so they kind of, that, that's the center of business and they were able to profit from it. No? So they, they were able to profit from it. No? So jumpstreet.com.ph, right? So companies, the companies will be posting, com posting company hiring there because they they've grown bigger already, so they have to pay for a premium, no? So magbayad ang mga companies just to put an ad, di ba? Okay, for a long time before, so I don't know guys, no? Okay, kamo mga batan on pa mga good mo, so kung mangyitag trabaho sa una, so excited ang mga tao kung naiman nila bulitin every Sunday, no? Because that's where the job market or kaya dito ka magtanaw. No? And then, for example, this case now, Jobstreet or katongmonster.com, they were able to look at this as an opportunity to make all those information online. No? So job hiring, job posting, and so they, they earn um, uh, plenty of money from that. No? So things like that, no, they were able to disrupt. Okay? So actually, there are also other examples in terms of disruptions, no? networking, right? So... I mean, social networking. So they were able to disrupt how people communicate. So your friends before you that you have not been able to see the last 20 years through Facebook, you're all able to see already, you know, things like that. So wait lang ha, guys. Please excuse me for two minutes. All right. So finally, I think this one is the. I I think this is a, one of the best example now that we can highlight your own frustration, no, your own story. And I think this was also highlighted in the case of the video earlier, sa Uber that um, they have difficulty looking for a taxi, no. So so that's that that was their experience. So meaning to say. Every time na nata frustration di ay, there is an equivalent opportunity for us to work on it. No? So, pwede di ay siya ng uh, opportunity for us to kind of start a business out from those frustrations. Because uh, perhaps nobody ever thought of coming up a solution with that. No? So, and that kind of problem that was presented to you guys can actually serve as a no, so a way for you to start the, the business. No? So that's what happened with Uber. No? So also the same story with Airbnb. No? So we talk about this because these are popular popular companies, diba? Right? So their own frustrations, their own their own personal experiences. No? So they started their own business from their own personal frustrations or experiences. So so meaning to say you can think of okay, if this problem was not solved by somebody else so maybe you can find that's the start of the idea generation now and indeed there is an opportunity there because that kind of problem has not yet been served no? so pwede gid siya okay so dirita mag focus no your own frustration and some of the mga frustrations niyo no? so you can begin thinking about uh, a business a tech based business coming from your frustrations so spend time where the action is likely to be. Uh, I think um, 
we have uh, 10 minutes now so so where where are most people go no so there is this uh, notion that kung asa gani dagan tao didto pud dagan nga opportunity no? so for example in the case of kani sa pandemic karon di ba sa pandemic so where is the action in terms of business no? so meaning to say these large companies big companies and even small companies actually like try to capture what are the opportunities that are presented to them that are not yet uh, solved during that time no so we go back to the example at the start of the pandemic that nobody like tried to develop as many as face masks as we want to be no to, to have no? so that means those were the opportunities where or that that's where the actions what we will be focusing on no so uh, solving problems in the pandemic no so there are also big companies that focus the resources on that in terms of developing uh, in, in developing kani mga ventilators no? so they shifted their manufacturing lines instead of produ producing other products such as automotive no cars uh, instead of producing cars they um, like for example some mercedes no? so they were they changed their um, one line of the factory in terms of producing ventilators no? just to help out no? so it may have been a business, but then they're also attending to the needs you know, of the mass market uh, in, or the hospitals that needing the, the the ventilators. So observe people at the leading edge. So, so that means that where the technology is going. So this is for high end. Uh, I don't know. For, for you guys, if you look at uh, opportunities that you can include uh, technologies into, for example, in in agriculture no so meaning to say introducing kana ba transform gyud nato ba kay we know philippines ang ag, ato mga agricultural process pagkalayo gyud kay no so dili pa tanan automated no so meaning to say if you can integrate this tech high tech no na high tech na mga idea then for example here is in the city ICT so they can implement blockchain to the existing ICT platforms but then it's not only for ICT no but then there are things that you can also integrate in the farming, the farming way of farming. So if we are into the agriculture engineering, how can we like maximize automation no, in farming? Okay. Next. Um, capture imaging trend by observing shifts, technology, legal, social shifts. So uh, again, um, technology wise, so um, we kind of look into the examples again and the mobile phone, no? so the transitions of the cellular phone business. And we know Nokia was left behind, but when Apple, uh, when Apple tried to shift the the mobile phone uh, market into the smartphone, and then a lot of people followed suit, no, like Samsung, and then now we have Huawei, uh, a lot of. Uh, other manufacturers, Oppo, so they're trying to, because there's a big market, no? because of the mobile phones, everybody's uh, using a mobile phone, so the market is so big, so that's why in technology, when they shifted to smartphones, a lot of the companies established their own companies to catch up, you know, to catch up with how this technology changes no? presented to them, no? so that's me. that means that uh, they were able to like, uh, yeah, introduce products, no? just like Oppo that has never been known before, no? So, so technology. And um, by adopting technology, actually, nga na po ng social na itong shifts, na so um, also through the platform sa Facebook, uh, that when Zuckerberg introduced this, so ang atong social na itong uh, behavior was also changed, no? Because um, we kind of oftentimes make ourselves available in in Facebook. No? So I, I don't know with you guys now, but right before I kind of a heavy user of Facebook, but lately uh, for the past one, two years, no, medyo naglay logo, no? so di na ko tig post. No? But before, like it was really like, okay, uh, adlaw, adlaw, no? So murag ang behavior ba, no? sayo sa buntag, mauna pag uh, kuha ng cellphone, gunit ng cellphone, no, so angana, no? So there was this social shift that was presented no, by uh, with the advent of the technology uh, cell phone that has pres been presented to us. Okay, so five minutes left.
Okay, that is included na technology shift. Di na ako ni Kwan. So, so, I think again, ang Uber, no? So, the way we find transportation today, so, if I go to Manila, no? So, ang akong, ang akong behavior is na change po, no? In terms of, dili na ko ganahan nga magpila sa taxi, sa katong mga white taxi of Bali, na na naging ko grab, no? So, grab, 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 every time, mabot ka ng airport, no? So, there's this cultural shift, no? And then, it's not me alone, no? So, so there's so many people. Okay. Um, that's it for now, guys. So, it's 11.26. I'll give you time, enough time to go to the LMS platform because the quiz is around 30 minutes. Uh, the number of questions is around 20 questions, no? So, um, any questions from you guys from the things that we discussed? Uh, question? Do you have questions? Questions from you guys? Do you have questions? Okay, none, none. All right. So, yeah. So, if you don't have questions, I'll let you go, Nano, because um, the quiz is uh, expected to start at 11.30. Go. Please go to the LMS. And if you have questions, feel free to put them in the chat box. I'll be monitoring so i i mean in the F, our messenger na group chat no gc so if you have questions about or clarifications later okay so with that um i i hope uh, you don't have i i hope you've learned something different today new today so we'll be having our meeting uh next thursday this thursday also all right so none for now so i'll see you on thursday thank you guys god bless give safe uh, everybody, please keep be, be vaccinated. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, guys. So...